Hello friends, this video introduction to 3D Geometry Part 3 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched Part 1 and Part 2. Let's take one example. We have to find whether the points A, B and C are vertices of a right triangle. Here also we'll do the same thing. We'll first find A, B, C, the distance A, B, B, C and C, A and then we'll check whether this AB, uh, the Pythagoras theorem is applicable. If yes, we'll say that they are vertices of a right triangle. If no, that means they are not the vertices of a right triangle. So let's find AB square first, A and B. So we'll say AB square is nothing but 10 minus 3 square, so this minus this, plus 20 minus 6 square, plus 30 minus 9 square. This came out to be 10 minus 3 this is 7 square plus 20 minus 6 14 square plus 30 minus 9 21 square and this came out to be 49 plus 196 plus 441 and that value is 6. Okay. 6. Now let's find BC square. So if you see BC square between B and C that is nothing but 25 minus 10 square plus minus 41 minus 20 square plus 5 minus 30 square. It came out to be 25 minus 10 that is 15 square plus plus minus 61 square is 61 square plus 25 square and that value came out to be that value is 15 square is 225, 61 square is 3721 plus 25 square is 625. That value is 4571. Similarly, we will find C A square between A and C. That comes out to be 25 minus 3 square plus minus 41 minus 6 square plus 5 minus 9 square correct that value is nothing but 25 minus 3 is uh, 22 square plus this is 47 square plus 4 square because 5 minus 9 is minus 4 minus 4 square is nothing but 4 square so this came out to be 484 plus this value is 2209 47 square and this is 16 so this value is 2709 correct now let's take the biggest one this is the biggest one so if you can prove that bc square is equal to ca square plus ab square that means we can prove it's a right triangle now let's let's see what is ca square plus ba square ca square plus ab square the value is 686 plus 2709 and that is nothing but this is not equal to 4751 because we told that bc square is equal to 4751 so this equation is not valid so it is not part of right triangle and that is our answer. What we have done, we have found AB square, BC square and CA square and we tried to prove to see if C, uh, the biggest side that came out was BC square that BC square is equal to CA square plus AB square or not. We found that it was not. So we have proved that this is not a right angle triangle. Let's take one more example. We have to find the equation of set of points P such that P A square plus P B square, this is sorry, P A square plus P B square is equal to 2 K square. This is the question. Where A, B are the points, this and this. So A is 3, 4, 5 and B is minus 1, 3 and 7. So if you see P A, let P B X, Y. P B X Y Z P B X Y and Z this is the point of P so if you say P A you want to find P A square is nothing but X minus 3 square plus Y minus 4 square plus Z minus 5 square correct similarly P B square will come out to be X minus minus 1 that is X plus 1 square plus 
y minus 3 square plus z minus minus 7 that is z plus 7 square. So we have got p a square and we got p b square. Now we are told that p a square plus p b square is equal to 2k square. So we'll add these two. So what we get is x minus 3 square plus x plus 1 square plus y minus 4 square plus y minus 3 square plus z minus 5 square plus z plus 7 square is equal to 2k square. This is the equation actually. If you want we can solve this further. So this becomes x square minus 6x plus 9. This becomes x square minus 2x or plus 2x plus 1. This becomes y square plus 16 minus 8x. This becomes plus y square plus 3 square is 9 minus 2 into 3, 6x. Plus this becomes z square plus 25 minus 10z. And again this becomes plus z square plus 49 plus 14z. This is equal to 2k square. So if you see x square x square that is 2x square so we'll take this value x square x square is 2x square 2x square plus similarly y square y square is 2y square 2y square z square z square is 3 2z square plus 2z square now we'll take the x part 6x minus 6x plus 2x minus 4x minus 4x so this and this is minus 4x this is y actually minus 8y and minus 16y that is minus 14y so this comes to minus 14y so this part is taken care and z part minus 10z plus 14z is equal to plus 4z and this is nothing but 2k square minus we'll add all this value 9 plus 1 10 10 and 10 this is 9 19 19 and 25 is 14 and this is 49 so this becomes total I think 1 naught and that is the answer correct so what we have done here I have just found the value of p a square and p b square and I said p a square plus p b square is equal to k square and we got the equation let's take one more example we have to prove that these are the vertices of a parallel to prove this, let's suppose this is point A, B, C and D, correct? We have to find the value of AB, BC, CD, B, A, B, B, C, CD and DA. So if you can prove that AB is equal to CD and BC is equal to DA, then we can say that this is a parallel. So first let's find the value of AB. So AB is nothing but root of 1 plus 1 square, 1 plus 1 square plus minus 2 minus 2 square plus 5 minus 1 square. That is root of 4, 2 square is 4 plus 4 square is 16 plus 4 square is 16. That is 1632 plus 4 root of 36 and that is 6. Similarly, let's find BC. BC is this and this. So this becomes root of 4 minus 1 square plus minus 7 plus 2 square plus 8 minus 5 square. That came out to be root of 4 minus 1 square is 9, 3 square is equal to 9. Minus 5, 7 plus 2 is 5. 5 minus 5 square is 25. And 8 minus 5 is 3. 3 square is 9. So this is nothing but root of 45. That, that is the value, root of 45. Now we will find CD. CD is nothing but root of 2 minus 4 square plus minus 3 plus 7 square plus 4 minus 8 square that value came out to be 2 minus 4 is minus 2 square is 4 minus 3 plus 7 
is equal to 4, 4 square is 16, 4 minus 8 is minus 4, minus 4 square is 16, that is root of 36 is equal to 6. Similarly, let me find dA, the value of dA. Let's find the value of dA. dA is nothing but root of minus 1 minus 2 square plus 2 plus 3, 2 minus minus 3 is plus 3 square plus 1 minus 4 square. Correct? So this came out to be root of minus 1 minus 2 is minus 3 square that is 9, 2 plus 3 is 5, 5 square is 25 and minus 1 minus 4 is minus 3 square is 9. So this is nothing but root of again 40, 9, 9, 9, 9 18 plus 25 root of 40. Three. This is also 43 actually. So if you see here we can say that AB is equal to CD is equal to 6 and BC is equal to DA is equal to root of 43. Thus we see that AB is equal to CD is equal to 6 and BC is equal to DA is equal to root 43. Thus it is not a, uh, this is a parallelogram because if you see that this is A, B, C, D. Here we are saying AB is equal to CD and DC is equal to BC is equal to DA. So this is nothing but a parallelogram. Hence we have proved that these values are vertices of a parallelogram. In this question we have to find the equation of the set of points which are equidistant from this is let's suppose A and this is B. From equidistant from A and B. So what we can do we can take this point let's suppose P is equal to XYZ and then we can find PA and PB. And we can equate. So we see PA is nothing but x minus 1 square plus y minus 2 square plus z minus 3 square. This PA square. Similarly, PB square, if you see, that is nothing but x minus 3, x minus 3 square plus y minus 2 square plus z minus minus 1 square. Correct? Now since we are told that PA is equal to PB, we can also say that PA square is equal to PB square, you square both sides, correct? So what we get is x minus 1 square plus y minus 2 square plus z minus 3 square is equal to x minus 3 square plus y minus 2 square plus z plus 1 square y minus 2 square y minus 2 square is cancelled and now we can solve this so this becomes x square plus 1 minus 2x plus z square this z was i think z minus 3 correct yes so this becomes z square plus 9 minus 6z is equal to x square plus 9 minus 6x plus z square plus 1 plus 2z. So you see x square, z square, x square, z square cancel, plus 9, plus 9 cancel, plus 1, plus 1 cancel. So what we get is, this x will come here, 6x minus x is equal to 2x is equal to 4x. I will get 4x is equal to, this will go there, so this becomes 6x, 6z plus 2z, this is equal to 8z or we get x is equal to this is the equation very simple what we have done we have taken a point p x y z we found p a square we found p b square and we told p a square is equal to p b square and got the answer thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again